Eaton Family Thunderdrome. It's the Muscle Car League. Me Too, Season 12. Race 1. We got Gas Monkey in lane 1. He is the top seed to this race. He's top 10 car. He came second overall in Meet 1. He is looking damn good to win this. We've got Hot Lava in 2. Firestorm the Veteran in 3. Candy Rouge in 4. And the Blue Meanie sits in lane 5. Blue Meanie might be the only chance of beating Gas Monkey. He is the next highest seed. But in reality, any of these five could win this. It's that close. Good drop to Blue Meanie. He leads onto the flat. But racing hard on the outside. Past Hot Lava and past the Blue Meanie is the Gas Monkey. The top seed. Top ten car. Oh, he wants a rematch. Next. There we go. As expected. Top seed. Gas Monkey. Second overall last last meet wants a rematch with bullet who leads this competition he's gonna get that blue meanie he was pretty quick out of the gate but couldn't sustain the speed gas monkey run, run him down no shame between the other two cars coming third and fourth but if you're team firestorm you're a little bit worried being that slow he's got to find some pace somewhere but points are at a premium two and it's a big one we've got three top 10 cars in this race we've got soundbreaker in lane three black beauty in lane four and the purple people eater in lane five top seed for this race would be soundbreaker in three neither of those cars scored a win last meet so they're anxious to get that first win of the season well, they've also got to face X Factor in lane two and White Knight in lane one. This is going to be a good race. Let's see who can make it to the to the big dance. Good tight race onto the flat. Sabrina's making the move off the middle. He's scorching away. White Knight's thundering on the outside to take second. But Soundbreaker, top seed, winning. Two races and no surprises. Top seeds going through. This time it's Soundbreaker. The big surprise, though, was White Knight getting there amongst the top tens, beating out Black Beauty. Oh, 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 that was a fair effort. And even X Factor managed to take out the Purple People Eater. What's happening there? He's having a terrible start to the season. This guy finished third last year. What's doing? Race three, and it is epic. It sees Bullet up the middle, the meet one winner and leader of the competition, taking on the current grand champion, Pearl, in lane five. This is the showdown. If Pearl wants to get his title back, he's going to take out the Bullet. And we've also got another top 10 car here in Sweet Ride in lane two. Oh, this guy, he won last, one last meet. He currently sits fourth overall. Then we have the Rusty Blood Pumper, the rookie in one. And the old guy in four. He's getting to be a veteran now. It's Mercury Rising. This is going to be a humdinger. Race Rusty and Sweet Ride on the outside, fighting for the lead. Bullets edging up the middle, he's got the lead, and Bullet! Bullet takes out everybody, Sweet Ride, and destroys the Grand Champion. You wanna be the best, you gotta beat the best, and that's what Bullet's done today. He put paid to the Grand Champ, who came in last, only securing one point. It was a very close race, there's no disgrace in it. But one point's not enough for the Grand Champ. Bullet also beat out Sweet Ride again. Putting him out of the championship race for the first time this year. 
So Bullet looking to go back to back. Four and the old rivalry continues. We've got El Campeon in lane five. It's a top ten car, sits third overall this season. Former champion of champions up against the old foe, old man Glory. Former six time grand champion, top ten car, looking to get his title back. It's always great when these two get together, it's always very close. Then we've got Grand National in lane four. He sits fifth overall with a win last meet. Very outstanding effort from the rookie. We've got Friesen Falcon up the middle. And Spitfire in lane two to round it off. Should be between the two old guys and maybe the Grand National. Let's see. Campion and National head to head on the inside. And National's getting the better of him. Old Man Glory and Spitfire head to head on the outside. Oh, look at Old Man Glory go. He got past the Grand National. Whoa, good win. 72 wins to Old Man Glory. Gets him into the championship race, looking at his 50th meet championship. Bullet stands in his way. That's a mouth-watering showdown there. Grand National and El Campeon didn't disappoint. I'll tell you who did disappoint, though, is Friesen Falcon. That's dead last two meets in a row. He has some work to do. Race five. We've got equal top seeds, both sitting in sixth position. That's the former four-time grand champion, Big Bad Bluer in two, and the impressive rookie, the 68 Camaro Custom Made. Good to see them go up against each other. No one in this field has a win yet, so that's gonna, that's gonna change today. We got Striper in four, Red Devil in three, the old veteran, can he come back today? And then we got White Chocolate, on the inside lane, lane one. This should be a good one. Let's see who gets that last spot in the championship race. Dropping like a bomb, big bad blue and striper. But he slows onto the flat. Red Devil and Watch Other drawing in the Big Bad Bluer, but they couldn't draw him all the way. Big Bad Bluer, the veteran, goes through. Great race between the top three here, with the Big Bad Bluer taking the lead on the flat, but the drawing him in was Red Devil and White Chocolate. Uh, he just had enough pace to outlast them. Striper disappointing, and whoa, from the... Penthouse to the outhouse, the Camaro, second and looking great last meet, second in his preliminary that is, to dead last here. Mind you, he had a pretty tough field. Thunderdrome is looking hot today. We've had some great racing, not too many surprises. Pretty much who we expected to get in got in. Maybe Old Man Glory was a little bit of a minor upset, but hey, he's a six-time former Grand Champion. That cancels that out. And he's next to Big Bad Bluer in five. Ten Grand Championships between them. That is epic. But the top seed for this race is the defending meet champion from last meet. Meet one. It's Bullet. If he can beat these two guys, he is legitimate. He is legitimate, I'm telling you. Soundbreaker in lane two. He's another lightning quick car. But he, Bullet has beaten him before. And Gas Monkey. And ditto for him. So this is going to be a great race. Bullet can really go a long way to a grand championship by beating the, this field. Glory in the blue are head to head. Bullet off pace in the middle. Look at sound break. A streak and pass. Gas monkey's past. Old man Glory's past. The big bad bluer from out of the blues. Soundbreaker wins. Coming from nowhere. Soundbreaker 
gets his second meet championship of all time, upsetting Bullet, Old Man Glory, and the Big Bad Blua. What a great field to win against. He's put his name right up there in the championship this year now. That is a great, great effort. Great, great race. No one was disgraced. Hope you enjoyed it as much as I did. This was epic today. Hope to see you next meet. Like and subscribe. See you later. Well, that surprise win by Soundbreaker rockets him up to third position. Gas Monkey in second. Bullet holds on to first by slimmest of margins. Looking pretty good. We got a lot of top 10 cars in the top 10. That's where you want them. Some good names there. Although Black Beauty is down in 13th. Well, there we go. Freezing Falcon and Firestorm bringing up the rear. Candy Rouge, not in great shape. But there it is, one last look, Bullet on top, Gas Monkey, Soundbreaker, Big Bad Bluer, Old Man Glory, El Campione, Sweet Ride, Grand National, Red Devil, Blue Meanie, and they, that's the top 10. Alright. Alright guys, see you next time.